over because I do not have my license with me, baby. It's Apple Pay and Vibe. I'm sitting here acting like it's just morning and I'm just so aesthetic, y'all. Um, honestly, I typically would wake up at this time. I'm like so serious. I stayed up one time with my friend at 4 a.m. talking about movies and old Nickelodeon shows and Disney shows and stuff. Good conversation and my sleep schedule has been shit ever since. Yeah, it's 1 p.m. I just got up and brushed my teeth and realized, oh shit, I'm supposed to be filming today. Now... I have some news, okay? Y'all not gonna be mad as me, but I'm going to just try to collect myself and not be too upset. So, if you know me, you know I love Brent Fias. I love him. Um, I dressed up for him as Halloween and practically broke the internet. Not really, but like I felt like I did. And I'm just a, a big fan of him and his music. Everybody basically knows. If you follow me, you know. Baby, I was supposed to go to his concert last night, September 15th, at 8 p.m. at the YouTube Theater. I was stressing the night before about my outfit, my hair, uh, Try, like I was on TikTok live stressing about all of those things trying to figure out what I was gonna wear trying to pick up because my cousin was gonna go with me and I was trying to figure out like her schedule and what time I should pick her up I was gonna go to the nail shop I had a nail appointment and everything and uh, I wake up yesterday morning and I see an email and a note here that says concert moved back to December 5th I'm gonna beat your ass. No, when I tell y'all I was sick to my stomach, dude, like I might be all smiley right now, but I was so upset. YouTube Theater posted on their Instagram that the concert was rescheduled and he shared it on his story. And I was so upset. Like, I was like, dude, like, if I didn't go through so much trouble figuring out the concert and like what I was gonna wear and everything, then I probably wouldn't have cared as much. But like, it's still Brent Fias, bro. I wanted to see him, bro. But it's not like I'm not gonna be able to see him. The show got pushed back to December, so. But a lot of people in those comments were saying, um, like they flew from like out of state or out of the country and this was like their only weekend off from work and yada yada which I feel really bad for them. I'm blessed that I didn't have to like make any crazy sacrifices to go and it was already in my city. Um... But I'm still upset, you know, as a fan, I'm still upset, you know. But also, I have to remember him as a person as well. It could have been some family emergency or who knows what happened. Like, I don't know what happened for him to push the show back. So I also have to be considerate of that. But I seen people in my DMs and I seen people in the comments talking about Kaya going ballistic. I know she about to be yelling in her next vlog. Really, dude? You didn't have to say all that. And look at you, I'm not even yelling. Um, so I was supposed to do like a vlog for y'all this weekend with, you know, the Brent Fire show, me running errands, nail shop, getting ready, all of that. Now I can't do that, but I'm deciding to vlog today anyway. A normal day in my life, I don't do anything. I'm so serious. I might watch some TV, make some food, go for a walk, and that's about it. And my camera battery is also about to die. That means I'm talking too fucking much. So, wow, let's change it. I had to switch cameras, so throughout this whole vlog, I'm most likely gonna be switching cameras back and forth. I'll probably bring this one when I go outside to vlog. Wait, I'm going outside? Girl, are you even going outside? Nah, I'll probably go outside. I'll probably bring this one just because it's smaller and more compact. As you can see, the quality is just worse, but I also sort of like it. Like, it gives me like a vintage look a little bit. I'm starting off my morning with, it's not even morning, dude. It's literally not morning. I try to drink kombucha as soon as I wake up on an empty stomach. I don't know what the fuck it does, but baby, it does something so I'm drinking this kombucha and then I'm drinking a glass of water one thing about me my stomach don't open up till 4 p.m. if you ever see me eating earlier than that it's probably because I forced myself just because I want to get it out the way like eating I said I have such a weird relationship with food like sometimes it feels like a hassle to even fucking make breakfast like I don't know cheers I should have put it in a wine glass to make me feel fancier <laughs> This one isn't that bad. I'm so surprised, y'all, because kombucha is usually, like, so intolerable for me. I know that it's, like, an acquired taste, but, baby, it'd be too much for me. For whatever reason, I decided to vlog today knowing that my camera batteries were not charged. So, <laughs> I am going to charge them, and I'm going to take a shower and get ready and do my hair. And I will see y'all. So, for me, it'll be, like, in an hour is when I'll see you guys. But to you, it'll be right now. So, I'll see you guys. Well, you, you were waiting for the newspaper to pop up, huh? Wait, okay. See you guys. It's still not gonna pop up yet. <laughs> All right, see you guys. I'm outside. I'm sorry that it's so loud. Yeah, no cries. Once you run a dog, I had them little piggies be trying to 
So I'm currently walking to the nail shop. I'm practically already there. There's a lot of noise. Like I think there's like a festival happening, but it's literally 4 p.m. in the afternoon now. I was waiting for my camera batteries to charge, which took forever. Hi. Um, let's see if I have. Thank you. That's the pleasant thing to see. No problem. Thankfully, I had some dollars because I usually don't carry cash at all. But before I go to the nail shop, I have to stop at the ATM. If you watch my channel, you know this is ritual because the nail shop I go to does not accept card. So let's do that and I'll probably see y'all in the nail shop. We got the money. The weather said it was supposed to be 70 something degrees. But of course, in LA, 70 feels like 100 fucking degrees. And I'm literally not even dressed crazy. Like I'm wearing a sweater, a t-shirt, and shorts. I have been fiending to get my nails done, so I'm so excited. Guess right now in the comments what color I'm gonna do. Hi. Full set. Full set. Full set. Nails are done. I love the guy that does my nails. He just always does his due dilly every time. I say this almost in every vlog. He's so nice, he's so sweet, his name is Sam. He's so fucking cool, like I love him. He even knew about like cameras. Like I came with this camera and he noticed and he was like, is that a new camera? You always come with like a bigger one. Love that. I'm gonna jaywalk right here. That little bitty itty ass starburst ass car. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm gonna do now. It's literally 6 p.m. almost. What the hell am I about to do? I don't know, I'm just outside. I feel like a New Yorker. Like I wish LA was one of those places where you could walk, and just walk like how New York is and there's just like shops and stores and stuff. But LA is not like that, unfortunately. Stopping at the gas station for a drink. Hi. Thank you. There is nothing more disappointing than a non crunchy leaf. <gasps> Hello, hello! This is a realistic day of my life. This is realistically what I do. If anything, hold on, the whole texting. <laughs> oh my! It was my niece. Um, yeah, on a day-to-day -day basis, I don't even fucking leave the house, but I wanted to make it a little excited for y'all. So. Cheers. Arizona half and half gonna do it every time. I know y'all probably wondering, like, girl, when the fuck are you gonna eat? Hold on, my mom's calling. Hello? Hi. Hi, Dallas. Hi. You outside? I'm vlogging, you wanna say hi to my vlog? Hey, vloggers, vloggers, whatever it is. Y'all know I'm not hip to it. <laughs> I've not ate nothing today. Like, realistically, y'all, y'all probably might be like, oh, I love her life. She has, like, such an aesthetic life. Actually, no one probably thinks that. But y'all probably like, oh, like, her life just seems so fun, baby. I don't do nothing all day. I am so sorry. It's realistic, bro. I'm not one of them YouTubers who fake it, bro. I am so sorry. I don't know what you want me to do. But right now, I'm about to figure out what I'm going to eat because I just got paid. Like, I'm literally only doing all this because I just got paid. I have not had my nails done because I ain't had no money. I ain't had no money. I'm sorry, bro. I don't know why I'm craving some Chinese food. I don't really eat it that often, but I don't want a plate because I don't eat leftovers and I'm not gonna finish it. So I'm gonna get fried rice and Beijing beef and call it a day. Now, I know the average 23-year-old is probably not a Twitch streamer, but I am. I stream a little bit, you know. Make sure to follow my Twitch if you're not. It's the same as my YouTube, Kaya Next Door, but I'm about to get ready to stream for a little bit. We streaming, guys! Here we are again. Here we are again. Let me give y'all a time check. I just got off stream and I don't have any toilet paper. I'm sorry, like this is what living alone is like, bro. I'm sorry. Like, bro, it's not all peaches and cream, sunshines and rainbows. I have literally the smallest amount of toilet paper left on the toilet paper roll in my bathroom. And I don't have any toilet paper. So I think I'm gonna have to go to the store to get some toilet paper. I kinda also wanna go to McDonald's to get a McFlurry. Is that wide back of me to be trying to get a McFlurry at 11 p.m.? Don't care, don't answer that. Let's get a drip check real quick and show you guys my fit. Also, OGs know who this is. This is, damn, what the fuck is your name? This is Paris. I've had this little teddy bear, whatever type of fish it is, since 2021. 
Now get the fuck out the camera. You getting too much shine. Nobody told you to take my shine. Fit check. I have on this regular golf dad tee that I got when I went thrifting a long ass time ago. BBL poking out. Ramen pantalones. Oh shit, that's my that's my fit, bro. Now we about to go ahead to CVS to get some toilet paper, and then we finna hit the doggy. My group chat jumping, bro. The host texting right. Girl, I got two fucking messages, and one of them is from my family. Wow. That's what I fuck your bitch, fat First off, fuck your bitch in the click and click. Claim to be a player, but I fucked your wife. I didn't fuck your wife. I fucked your husband. Do that matter, or can I still say that part? First off, I just want to say, fuck all y'all. Is somebody in my reflection? Oh my God, that's me, bro. You know, guys, late night drive with Kaya. I be thinking about the most random scenarios at night. Like, I literally was just thinking as I was walking down my staircase, what if someone just hit me with a, a brick behind my head? What if I'm really just happy, like, hey, I'm about to go outside, go get some ice cream, go get this toilet paper real quick, run my errand, and then someone just hit me and be like, fuck your plan. Is that a sign of a mental illness or something? Let me know. I hope I don't get pulled over because I do not have my license with me, baby. It's Apple Pay and Vibes. Why are you? Fuck you I'm the main character in the movie right now. Girl, <laughs> you going to get some tissue so you can wipe that ass. Alright, guys. Oh my god, I thought I wasn't recording. <laughs> like, I literally was just staring at the fucking thing. Like, was I not recording? I was about to be so pissed. So great. I love going out at night by myself talking to a camera. So amazing. Every man in there was looking at me. I get I look good. But what do you expect my outfit to look like? It's literally midnight, bro. Also, we're not going to go to McDonald's because I forgot Jack in the Box has really good shakes. And I'm right by Jack in the Box. So let's get a milkshake from Jack in the Box. And McDonald's be, be trying me. I remember uh, one time I went to McDonald's uh, to get a McFlurry and a large fry. I get there. It was midnight. It was a little past midnight. But oh, well, y'all restaurant. Y'all supposed to be open 24 hours. I get there. They tell me, oh, we only accept cash. I was pissed off. So I took my ass to a different McDonald's. Same thing. Oh, we only accept cash. How about y'all only accept that ass? Whooping when I whoop that ass. But I came ready, came prepared, and I have $20 in cash because I never really have cash. But looks like I won't even be needing it because I'm not even going to McDonald's. Everybody in there, mama trying to go to Jack in the Box now, like, bro, because they know that I'm going. Like, damn, y'all only y'all only going right now because y'all heard that I was going. Honestly, I think that man trying to follow me home because why he haven't drove off yet? And he already left before me. I'm delusional and shit. <laughs> I'm so sorry. At least I'm aware, bro. Hi, can I do a regular Oreo shake, please? That'll be all. I should have just asked if they would have gave it to me for free, bro. I'm gonna pay with cash. That way I can keep the change in my car. Adulting shit. Y'all don't know about this. I'm also very sad that Brent canceled his show like I talked about earlier, but it's okay. But we finna play some Brent. Damn, what the fuck these people ordered a whole restaurant? Jack in the Box sell every every type of food. Burgers, tacos, egg rolls, anything you can name. Dessert rolls, ordered sushi off the restaurant. Jack in the Box might as well sell sushi. Thank you. You too. Mm -hmm. What y'all know about this, bro? I don't wanna let you know. The throwback Nickelodeon and Disney songs. It's not all of them, but it's like a good amount. It's like my favorite one. I'm gonna link my Apple Music in the description. My Apple Music is Kaya on Pluto. If y'all ever like want any of my playlists or whatever, a lot of y'all do follow me on Apple Music. But yeah, this playlist is called Core Memory, and I know I'm gonna forget to link the playlist, but it's on my Apple Music, so make sure y'all check it out. Cause I just got so hyped listening to that Cheetah Girl song. Oh baby, party like you're ready for so much more.
all, they could have added me. Why the fuck they ain't add me on the Cheetah Girls? I could have been, I could have uh, replaced uh, Raven. We both black. <laughs> While I'm out here, I should actually try my Nobody. skater girl techniques one more time. You haven't seen my last video when I became a skater girl. You should go watch that. I'm gonna leave an I card. I'm a say, I'm glad you found you right here. Crumbs in the world, that feels in the best. Some trunks in the trunk, you need to go out the best. Skating ain't for me. need a pick, my skin's soaked with the sun. They shake your hands with you bums. Bunny hopper, the new car doors, they lift open. The lake water. I hate to say it, but I'm literally just a fucking 23 year old kid who they somehow let get an apartment. And that sounds so cringy, like, oh, I'm not like every other young adult. I'm different and I'm a kid at heart. <sighs> But I mean it when I say it. I just be doing shit, bro. It's past midnight. This is around the time I would start winding down and, you know, chilling. Normal days, I'm either just in my bed all day, editing or streaming or filming a YouTube video, aka what I'm doing now. But y'all, we're finna go to the bathroom and do some skincare. I don't remember the last time I showed y'all my skincare, but it definitely has changed. And I think I'm also going to do a face mask tonight. I bought these Hello Kitty face masks a while ago, and I have no idea where they are, so I actually need to find them first. But we're about to do skincare, so... Let's go. Hello, hello. We in the bathroom now. A little one on one personal connection time. Treat me like what you I'm um, gonna put my band on first and foremost. And then we're gonna put our bonnet on. Boom, we good. Wash my hands first. Duh. Y'all heard COVID coming back, bruh. Hands gotta stay clean. If only y'all could see all the dirt that just came off my hands, bruh. That's actually like so dirty. I'm gonna use a cleansing balm first. This is a Neutrogena makeup remover balm. I'm telling y'all. Come on, bro. Y'all gotta get with it. Oh, I'm getting thrown off my game. Because I literally would usually take off my contacts first. Favorite part of the day is skincare. Simply because I like when my face feels clean. One big pet peeve of mine, and also a reason why I don't wear makeup as often as I want to. Like, I wish that I could be one of those girls who get up and just does their skincare and then does their makeup every single day and just looks cute every day. I don't be feeling like doing my makeup every day. That's just a lot of work to me. Um, Even though I want to look cute every day, I just don't be feeling like it. If I had a makeup artist to do my makeup, I would be fly every day. And two, I don't like the feeling of it after a long day. Like just having makeup sitting on your skin. I just love the feeling of clean skin. I'm sure everyone can agree. So I'd be so happy and ready when it's time to take it off. Plus I just love doing skincare, so. And I just started recently using this Kojic Acid soap and it's supposed to help for like hyperpigmentation and dark spots. I only use it, I try to use it maybe once a week considering like, you know how it be when you add a new thing to your skincare, you don't wanna break out and this soap is supposedly supposed to be really strong. And I only use the soap on the areas where I actually have hyperpigmentation. Rub it in, let it sit for maybe 15 seconds, and then wash it off. Y'all, I'm not no skincare professional. I'm just telling y'all what I do. Before you ask, I got these from Amazon. I think it came with three. They're super cute. Brilliant C Boost Printed Essence Sheet Mask. Vitamin C and retinol for youth. They're so cute though. Like the packaging is so cute. I almost don't even want to open it, but... Open it up. What? Who face shaped like this? What the fuck? Ain't nobody face shaped like this. <laughs> Y'all. The fact that I have to put my glasses on over it is crazy. I was expecting this face mask to be like, oh, cutesy, ooh, woo. Like, so cutesy skincare. She does skincare. I look like a fucking mummy. A scary ass mummy. What the fuck? I actually like these face masks. I, I oh, not, it's still makeup right there. I actually do like these face masks. I love the after with sheet masks because you just rub it in. Uh. Because I did that sheet mask, I'm not gonna stack my face with my usual serums and everything. So, I usually use all three of these. Uh, Exorbic Acid, Niacinamide, and Caffeine Solution. Also, Alpha Arbutin. But tonight, I'm gonna be using the Absorbic Acid, Ascorbic Acid, however it's said. Caffeine Solution. I use Cetaphil moisturizer, but baby, it's all out, but I'm finna get my money worth. Don't forget that neck. 
usually when I do like harsh skincare and like harsh um, face mask, like a clay mask or something that's like over drying, that's when I like to slug because I feel like my skin needs the extra moisture. But since I just did a very moisturizing face mask, I'm not gonna slug. Y'all don't know what slugging is. It's basically where you take Aquaphor or Vaseline and you do a thin layer on your face and it's supposed to just lock in the moisture of all your products. I do a little Aquaphor on my eyelashes. That's my skincare. Some of them asked me in my TikTok live, so what is your job? Like, do you even work? I said, my job is skincare and drinking matcha. I ate that little one. I ate that little one. Well, y'all, I'm gonna get comfy and cozy in my bed. It's literally 1.55 a.m. I have nothing else, you know? I have nothing else. This is literally a day in my life. I just do a bunch of bullshit to entertain myself until it's nighttime, and then I get to cuddle up and read a book. I'm currently reading Monday's Not Coming. If you guys were wondering, I've been waiting to read this book all day. I like to read before bed because it's kind of like a little treat, like something to look forward to at the end of the day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you made it this far in the video, comment water to let me know know that y'all be drinking water and y'all insides not about to explode down oh fuck i didn't brush my teeth just did all that skincare but didn't brush my teeth fuck it <laughs>